organization, time management. But those are the things that... Why are you turning off? Please don't turn off. Technology, honestly, just... Hey guys, okay, I'm gonna be straight up honest with you. I've never really felt so organized, honestly. <sighs> I, I don't know when I'm gonna show you this video, but I'm gonna record myself opening it because it's so cute! It's a little notebook. It looks small, but I promise you it's so good. It's called Philofax, but the whole point of it is that apparently you're supposed to be able to replace the pages, like, and reorganize them as you go, which I thought was such a big feature. I can just open it and just take the notes and then I can just rip the page off and then place it somewhere else. I really wanted the lilac one but the lilac one was like 17 pounds and this one was like 12 so we both know that the green one's much better, right? The green one's so much better. You can also buy the refills for dotted pages and gridded pages and it comes with a ruler which is so useful for architecture students. The cover feels quite nice. It's like faux leather, but doesn't feel like cheap. <gasps> the elastic. It's quite thick. Feels like quite nice and high end. Let's see. Ah, oh, it comes with like craft boards so it doesn't bend during the delivery. That's kind of cute. I like that. Comes first with a ruler, right? Nice little ruler. Very useful. And the whole repositionable thing. I think I'm, I can show you with the ruler. These little holes. They open up and so it allows you to kind of snap them back in and this is the whole system of Filofax so you can reposition the sheets this way and also the dividers so you've got the ruler and then you've got the sheets here obviously and then the dividers which you can also buy in different colors and things and they all come with a little pocket oh no it doesn't come with a little pocket which one comes with a pocket Oh, just the first one comes with a pocket. Well, they all could come with pockets, in my opinion. Let's try and take one page out and see how it goes. Uh, change the order of your notes. You can just pop them back into the place. It's lovely! Oh, it's so cute! Oh, I love it so much! Hello! Hey guys, okay, I'm gonna be straight up honest with you. I was just editing the video that I recorded earlier and I felt really corrupt. I had not even tried it and I was already giving my opinion about it. Like, I don't want to be those people. I don't do that kind of stuff. You know, I, I've, I've had it for a few weeks now and I have some things that I want to say. You know, I'm doing a free ad here simply because I love stationery and that's for my pure love of stationery. So I'm gonna be damn honest about it, okay? There are really good things about this. Honestly, my organization has improved. It has improved. It's just a really smart concept to be able to reposition your pages. There's nothing new about this yet. It's such an effective way to keep your notes organized. I have my little notes for YouTube here and I think it does what it promises it does, you know? Like I can just, I can remove it and place it here for me to read it and then I pop it right back in when I'm finished. It's amazing. For pinups, imagine having all your sketches and then you just rip them off, then you can just put them right back into your book. I love that. I love that. Honestly, don't, sorry, nobody does it better. I think it's more ecological because you can buy the amount of sheets that you need and you're only going to use them if you write on them and if not then you can always save it for later. You don't have to throw the whole book away because you've already used it. The problem is that I have 300 freaking books that I buy and then I end up not finishing them. Half this book is empty but I'm not gonna go through everything and see which bits of pages are white. That sort of thing is really good. You buy as much paper as you need. You don't need to buy a thick ass book because you're gonna write a lot. You just, you buy it gradually, you save money, you save the planet again. Now, what does not really work? I'm gonna give you the juice. Things that don't work, okay? The sheets are quite thin in the sense that if you remove them and put them back in, maybe I'd say four times, it, it the little flaps, the little fins start getting a bit damaged and they don't really work as much anymore. So when you start flipping the pages, they come out whenever they want, basically. <laughs> they get a life of its own. So I'm not sure how that could be resolved. 
but maybe like thickening this actual part where the holes are so that they don't get damaged so easily. And also in this particular notebook there's not a lot of space for you to put your sheets. I think there's space for like 50 something, 60 sheets max. I don't think that's enough. Like where do you store the sheets once they're once you're done using them? Uh, I don't know. But I think I guess that's that's a minor kind of thing. Like you want more space, you're gonna have to pay more Lola. I'm a little bit stingy and I wanted everything to be perfect with this one. <laughs> but obviously it's a small notebook, it was the cheapest there was. So there's nothing really to complain. I'm just being a bitch. But I found the refills really hard to find. Ryman sells their notebooks, so I figured they would have the refills, but they don't have the refills. So it, it, you would have to go either via Amazon or their own website. Which is, you know, it's a little annoying for me because I like to go and feel and see. But I did buy the other refill, the, the squared one, gridded lines. I don't know if it's grid, grid, grid lined. I don't know how to say it, but I don't know if you can see it. Um, yeah, it's quite nice. It's just, you know, they could put a little bit more care into their sheets. Um, I do think. And they cost about two pounds. So it's not, it's not a bad price. Uh, I particularly think it's worth it. Would I buy it again? I'm going to keep it short and sweet. I would definitely get it again simply because I've never really felt so organized honestly I I thought it would help but not as much as it did so <laughs> I'm pretty positively surprised with it and yeah I mean for 12 pounds I think that was that was good <laughs> for more than that I don't know <laughs> as students we are we don't have money to splurge so i don't know if i'd pay more than 12 pounds on it but usually on amazon i've seen there there's usually one or two colors they're always a little bit cheaper so yeah if you don't mind having a little bit of a dull color <laughs> and i'm really excited to get the blank refill so i can actually sketch in it and add little files it's nice because what you can do as well is you can cut the sheets in half like i did once when you make a little file sometimes you just want to add a little bit extra drawing in there to make things fancy and you can <laughs> just cut a sheet in half and you just add that la it's it's cute it's cute i like it i like it it's my opinion and yeah if you want to purchase one i've got the link in the description below and i think actually i'm gonna introduce my next video here you might have noticed i'm in a little bit of a different place I did something that my heart asked to, me to do. People following me on Instagram already know what it is. But I'm gonna keep it secret here, so if you wanna know, subscribe. If you don't, I'm gonna be very upset. Because I spend my time and I put my little face online, okay, on the internet for everybody to see so I can give you the information that you wanted. So, subscribe. Okay, I'll go now, Jesus Christ. Making a joke of myself publicly. Thank you so much for watching this video and spending these couple minutes with me and yeah, I guess I'll see you next time. Bye.